All right, so here we are with the controls. Um, we have counter controls to the power button. We're gonna be on. We have agitation, which is the blade that sweeps the inner wall of the hopper. We're gonna put that on with fill, so the blade will turn on when the auger turns. Mm -hmm. We have a jog button. That just turns the auger, say at the beginning or the end of the, uh, a cycle, to get it through the auger. And then the clutch, this is what drives your auger, is gonna be in the on position. Right now we're setting we're setting the counter at 300, which is three turns. Um, we can change this very easily if we wanted to do, say, a three three full turns of the auger and one one hundredth of a turn. It can go to one one hundredth of a turn. For now, we're going to turn three full rotations and one one hundredth of a turn. And you can see the product coming out right here. This is a non free falling powder. We can change this again, coming back up here. We can make it so, um, we'll turn it, say, one turn. You, so you'll quickly do a, um, you'll calibrate how many turns you want by just taking this measurement onto a scale and seeing how much is coming out. It is accurate as long as we're keeping the products fed. Say we want to go to um, 11 turns. Again, this is a non-free flow powder going, not going into a container right now. I'm going to go ahead and show you up here the agitation. So as we're filling, you can see the blade is on the inner wall, the auger is down the center, and the blade turns as the auger is turning. Now again, coming back down, this is the jog button right here. So if we're gonna, we have a little bit left in here we want to get out, we just jog it. And that is it. Thank you.